Dude, I can't believe we survived that. Did you seriously just try to negotiate with a battle droid by challenging it to a dance-off? Well, it seemed like a good idea at the time. I'm officially on solo missions from now on. Sucks to suck, Snips. As my Padawan, you have to deal with my unconventional teaching methods, and you have to like it. That sounds like abuse. Well, no, it... Huh. Is it? Because that's what Obi-Wan told me when I was his apprentice. Is that abuse? I don't really care. Hey, speaking of Obi-Wan, where is he? It's time for the talk show. Oh, he said he was going to be busy today. He had someone to do. But that's not cool. It's not even the first time he's... Wait, someone? Yeah, that's what he said. I think he meant to say something, but, you know... Oh, yeah, I know. That's it. I'm calling him. Huh, it usually doesn't ring twice. Well, he did say he was busy. You've reached the voicemail of Jedi Master Obi-Wan Kenobi. Emphasis on the Master. Jerk. I'm currently navigating diplomatic complexities with my homies. You know the drill, just leave a message Oh, Mr. Obi-Wan Kenobi One, I'm stuck in the washing machine again. Will you help me? Uh, forget it. May the Force be with you always. Uh, he, uh, he changed his voicemail. Was that voice Cody? To be fair, he usually answers his calls. I wonder if something happened to him. It's okay, Snips. We can do it just the two of us. We can have some wholesome master and apprentice bonding time. Don't take this the wrong way, Sky Guy, but I've had my fill of alone time with Anakin for the year. But the year just started. Yep, and since Padme isn't here, I guess we're done. See you next week. Wait, I need to do this. It's part of my therapy now. They say it helps to air out my problems. Fine, but I'm not doing this without Obi-Wan. Um, can you keep a secret? Snips, you know me. I'm the best at keeping secrets. I didn't tell anyone about your obsession with hentai duck manga or your peeping tom hole into Rex's quarters. I was under anesthesia when I said that. That's not fair. I wouldn't have even been in the hospital if you didn't throw me out of the window into space. It was so funny, though. Okay, yeah, it was pretty funny, but still. Anyway, what's the secret? Remember a few months ago when we were all at Obi-Wan's place? I hid a hollow projector in his laundry room so I could see if he and Cody were, you know... Huh. All right, Snips. That's really clever. But also... disturbing? Isn't that, like, illegal? Since when do you care if something is illegal? Fair point. I'm calling him. Hey, Ben? Would you still love me if I was a clanker? You know I would, my dear. Give me one second. I'm going to go get something. <laughs> Be quick, my dear. My socks are coming off as we speak. Hey, who's there? Hello? Anyone? Oh, back so soon, dear. Uh, General Skywalker. What are you... how... Cody, what the hell are you doing in Obi-Wan's place? I thought you were stationed on an Axis. I, uh, got an early release from the assignment. Answer the question. Why are you here? I'm just... Uh, doing... Laundry. See? Oh, all right. I guess that makes sense. Yeah, and I'm just here because, you know, it's nice to share some battle strategies with my general and all. I've heard you share a little more than battle strategies. Uh, he only let me put his saber up my ass one time. It wasn't that big of a deal. He did what? I'm fucking with ya. You Jedi are so gullible. Whatever. Where's Obi-Wan? He's late to the talk show again. I'm not sure, actually. He could be... All right, Commander Codelicious. I got the lube. I hope your socks are off. I'm itching to get... Oh, you've got to be fu... <laughs> Fucking kidding me. There's no way. Ahsoka, am I tripping or did that just happen? I heard it. Pretty loud and clear. Is that what it looks like? We were... uh... Oh no, I'm not letting this slide. I've been waiting like 20 episodes for this moment right here. Cody, I have so many questions. Save it for later. I'm not having Cody as a talk show guest. Oh, come on, Ben. I think it's time. Oh no, please don't use your sexy voice. Aw, oh, you don't like my sexy voice? But you always said you... Oh my Lucas, cut that out. I'm trying to stay soft here. Come on. Let's all go to the set and do a proper talk show, yeah? Okay, I'll get it all set up. Why does this always happen to me? 
Why can't I just do a favor for my commander without it seeming suspicious? A favor? I would really say it was more me who was going to give out favors. You love it when I put my feet on you. Listen, I only got the lube to help you get unstuck from the washing machine, but no worries, you managed to get out just fine without me. But that's not what... It's so strange how small that doorway is. Makes pulling out the dry clothes so difficult, doesn't it? Oh, that's good. I get it now. I'm sure they'll buy that. What do you mean, buy it? It's what happened. They'll have to believe it. But I was going to give you a... Yeah, don't even bother. I think you forgot I never left the call. Fuck. See you lovebirds when you get here. I can't believe he was going to lie to us. This old man just doesn't know when to quit. I was kind of hoping they would just get back to it so I could watch, but... Ahsoka, stop being horny. You want to talk, Ben. This is unreal. I've suspected this for so long, but I never really expected it, you know? All right, fine. You caught us. Are you happy now? Actually, I haven't felt such a conflict of emotions since Padme gave me a handjob in the sand bath. What? Yes, let's worry about Anakin's bizarre sex life. That seems more fun. Nah, it's pretty boring. It's just the occasional spanking these days. Apparently Padme is too busy as the Chancellor. Plus she's pretty mad at me for restarting the Clone Wars. I think we all are. But let's focus on the lovebirds for now. Tell me, how did this all start? Were you two really just doing laundry on that fateful day? Yes, we were. It was just laundry. It was just laundry, actually. The facilities of Camino were down, and the General allowed me to do it there. It was an innocent coincidence at first. But there are so many other instances. Was it all just laundry? Hey, I said it started like that. It evolved. No, it didn't. I mean, I respect it and all, but it's still kind of gay. Don't act like you and Captain Sex aren't close. Uh, no? I don't know Rex like that. He's just, I don't know, he's like a co-worker. That's the way it should be. The Jedi Code kind of forbids all this. Show me where in the Jedi Code it says I can't have a personal relationship with a clone trooper. That feels too specific to be included. And besides, our relationship is a little extra personal. I don't know what you're talking about. Ben... I've been respectful of your choice and all to be quiet about this, but there isn't much reason to hide it anymore. No, I'm just here to prove to you all that it isn't what it looks like. There's just been a lot of odd coincidences that make it seem like we're sexually involved, but that's not the case, I promise. If that's how it is. I've never met a dude more uncomfortable with his sexual identity. I mean, it makes sense. The Jedi Order is loaded with some deep internal homophobia. Getting butt-fucked is actually grounds for expulsion. Those rules have been relaxed for a long time. That's so. How do you know? Well, because we've done it so many- Just a guess. What about the ass shaving thing? Oh, yeah. Obi-Wan asked me to shave his ass that one time. We ended up making it a video. It's already pretty viral, actually. There's nothing weird about that. Just a couple dudes and some ass hair. I haven't actually checked your OnlyFans in a while. Are you still making content there? Uh, I'd rather if you didn't check. Oh, yeah. Our latest one was pretty fun. Two men, one washing machine. Okay, I do admit, that one was fun. What the hell is this series? The Phantom Boner? A Nude Hope? The Last Orgasm? Whoa, the Revenge of the Piss. Nah, that last one was Ben's idea. Good to know your side income is doing well, Master Kenobi. Thank you, dear Ahsoka. It's hard work, but it pays well. Okay, how do you explain these videos then, Obi-Wan, if you're still insisting nothing is happening? Well, you know the saying, 20 credits is 20 credits. The people demanded more and I became a millionaire. And that's work. It's different. This one looks fun. Great thumbnail on it. Oh, 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 I have a very oh, good feeling oh, about oh, this. Oh, oh, These are not oh, the balls you're oh, looking for. Oh, oh, I... What the fuck? Can we talk about something else? Like what? The whole appeal of having Cody on was to explore your relationship with him. I guess we could talk about something else. Any ideas? Yeah, I got one question sort of unrelated. I gotta know how you became a commander, because Rex tells me you're really shit at your job. Whoa, careful with who you're fucking talking to. Cody is the best at what he does. Aw, oh, thanks, Ben. That's so sweet. But I was promoted before the war even started. I've been a commander the whole time. And you've more than earned your keep, Cody. You're an excellent trooper. Probably the very best. 
That means so much, coming from the best Jedi general in the Republic. Uh, can you two stop with the dick riding? What dick riding? I never rode on his dick. I did not mean it like that. Oh. <laughs> well, unless you count that one time. Wait, what? There's one here about a glitter bomb. What's that about? Would you stop looking at that crap? Oh, the glitter thing was supposed to be a wholesome video. We, uh, we got a little carried away with it, though. Wait, Sky Guy, was that blue glitter? Uh, yeah, why? Master Kenobi, remember when I saw your robes were covered with that and you told me it was from a Jedi Council bonding exercise? It was still a bonding exercise, and I am a Jedi Council member. So what I told you was true, from a certain point of view. You gotta start using that excuse more often. I'm sure it'll come in handy later on. What else have you told me that's only half true? Was that part of your armor that said Cody's bitch even written by a 212th clone? Oh, yeah, that was me. Shame he lost that armor in a fire. Hold on, did I miss something? Your armor had Cody's bitch written on it? Oh, yes. Cody really wanted to brand me or something. Probably a good thing R4 burned it. Honestly, that would have looked bad during our annual Jedi Council strip inspection. Oh, I can't believe it. I didn't know it had that. I never would have burned them. Hold on, I'm confused. I thought R4 burned them. What are you talking about? I kind of helped him. I was jealous that Obi-Wan got such cool Jedi General armor and mine looked like it was drawn by an eight-year-old. Well... Most of the clones are about that age. That's what you get for outsourcing your designs to the army. It was you that burned my Jedi General outfit? That shit was so fucking clean. How could you? I'm sorry, Master. I was jealous. I know it was wrong, but it's not fair you get to be dripped out like that. You were stealing all the bitches. Hmm. I do admit. Your ass doesn't look as nice as it was in that outfit. I never thought about it, but yeah, it isn't as firm. Used to be so... Edible? Was going to say tight, but sure. I, you, but, shut up, Anakin. I didn't even say anything. You thought something. All I was thinking was that it's kind of gay to comment on a dude's butt. I thought you were all about inclusivity. Weren't you okay with all of this? Hey, I call it like I see it. Cody, come here. Uh, what is it, General? I want you to execute Order 66 on Anakin. Ha! You think that's gonna work? I'm literally the most powerful Force user ever- Ah! Whoa! Great shot, Cody! That'll teach him. Good soldiers. Follow orders. Yep, they do. Good job. Good soldiers follow... orders. Whoa, where do you think you're aiming that thing? Die, Jedi scum! Uh-oh. I think you fucked up, Master. Cody, please. Let's talk about this. You should have let me receive every now and then, asshole. I like it too. Ugh, why can no video we make be normal? Just once! It's all I ask! You're dealing with the cleanup. I'm just a bystander for this one. That's fine. I kind of wanted to do something with Cody's body. I mean, uh, I'd like to do Cody's laundry one last time before I, uh, pull him back out of the world between worlds. I'm starting to think you need more therapy than Anakin. Nobody can help fix what I am. I'm not forgiving you until you come in the sand. You can't make me! Well, that was embarrassing. You're back already? Did you finish your, uh, laundry? Oh yes, I always finish early with Cody helping. Thank you so, so much to our insane tier Patreon supporters. Anakin Skywalker, Blunt BBM, Darth Musician, Leonel Barina, Plus Gear, Thestral Pony, Vasu Patel, and Woodston. You're the real chosen ones. Or something, I don't know. Words are hard. Comment your favorite clone trooper if you made it this far. See you next time. <laughs>